Okay, so you want to know more about the Basilisk, how to tame it and what it can do? Well, I think you came to the right place. The Basilisk, a creature that tries to hide and blend in nature, tries to lure you with its nice tentacles. Like it is yummy, yummy, yummy. I want to have that in my tummy, tummy, tummy. But when you get closer, it will jump out of the ground and it will try to kill you. And it will spit poisonous balls at you. So you better run before you die. This creature is really awesome, it has some amazing abilities, we're gonna check those out in a moment as well. But first of course you wanna know how to tame it. Well, I needed to do some digging, I needed to do some testing, but I think I did enough testing to show you how to tame this one. So let's dive right into this. So you wanna tame one, well first you need to find one, and uh, they can be hidden, just like that over there. A level 50 and uh, yeah then you need to get closer and they wake up or wake up they jump out of the ground and are gonna attack you what you need to do is not knock it out because you are not able to tame it that way no you need eggs just like with the uh, titan aboa on the island for example you need fertilized eggs but uh, apparently you can also use normal eggs so i have some eggs spawned in they say that dimitrodon eggs are really good and uh, golden Hesperonus eggs but we don't have the Hesperonus on aberration so uh, yeah you need to transfer that or something but if you want to keep it aberration well Dimitrodons they are here and they say normal eggs so yeah uh, we will test it out if and see if it works I also have fertilized Carno egg and fertilized Dodo egg I want to see the difference with that and I also have the Rock Drake eggs so uh, yeah let's see uh, let's drop some down so first I'm gonna drop the Dodo eggs down uh, I don't think it will work, but uh, yeah, let's test it out, shall we? Hello! And of course you need to be fast. And, oh, why aren't you coming to me? Hello? Hello, 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 hello. Okay, let, let's, uh, let's uh, bite it, bite it. Come on. Now some uh, yummy eggs here. Let's see, are you coming now? Oh, yes, you're coming. Oh, whoa, look out, look out, look out. Oh my god. So, it didn't take the eggs. No, it didn't. So, oh, they are all coming now. No, 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 no. Okay, let's drop the Carno eggs. And, oh, I only wanted to drop one. Not two. No, go to this side. Go to the other side. And drop it. Okay, we dropped it. So now it needs to come. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Get away, you. Get away. Get away, get away. We are busy with the video. Come on. Come on. Are you gonna eat it? Whee! Well, ooh, ow, 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 ow. You didn't eat it. Nope, 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 nope. So let's try the Mitrodon egg. I got one down over there, so uh, let's check it out. It doesn't have any taming uh, things on it, so please grab it. Ooh. Come on, I need to grab this one. No, 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 no. Eat the egg. Alrighty, so let's try out the Rock Drake eggs. There we have a level 50. And the Rock Drake eggs, I have a low level one, uh, or a high level one and a low level one, a level 4 and a level 40. I want to see if there is a difference. So we're going to start off with the lowest one. So let's get closer. It comes out of the ground. And shoot, shoot a ball to me. Yes, it is going to shoot. So now we're going to drop the level 4. Come on. Ooh. No, 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 no. You need to eat egg. Come on. Eat the egg. Eat the egg. Come on. You're not hungry or something. Ow, 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 ow. No. Come on, eat the egg. What are you doing? Come on now. Eat the egg. I think you ate it. I think you ate it. Let's see. Yeah, 48.1%. Okay, so that is with the level 4 egg. Okay, there we are again. On that side, there it is, a level 50, just freshly spawned in. So we're gonna drop the egg here. So we have the level 40 left, there we go. I'm really curious if it will do something or not. So are you coming? Come, come, come. Come, 
Come. Hmm. Don't hit us. Eat the egg. Did you eat it? No, you didn't eat it. Oh, you're cheating on us. Come on now. Oh, oh, dang. Oh, that was not smart. Almost dead. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh, it ate. Oh, it ate the carnal egg now. Did you see that? Oh, it destroyed the carnal egg, I guess. Hmm, that's weird. Okay, come on, come on, come on. You need, you need to grab this one. You need to grab this one. We know you want it. Did you eat it? Did you eat it? Oh, yes. You, yes, you eat it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Show us, show us. 48.1% as well. Isn't that weird? But it is nice to know that the level of the rock break egg doesn't matter at all. So if you have a low level egg or a high level egg for the taming process, it doesn't matter. It gives both for level 50 on default rates 48.1%. Okay, awesome. All right, and once you have a beautiful... No, 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 what is going... Oh, stop, stop, stop making videos here. Stop, <laughs> stop it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> once you have one tamed, uh, you get attacked. Oh, my God. Okay, let's try it again. <laughs> Alrighty, and once you have a beautiful basilisk tamed, what you need to do now is get a saddle. So, let's check out the saddle. Basilisk. At level 85, you can get it. And what you need to do is craft it in the smithy. You need 85 semantic paste, 150 fiber, 45 green gems, 270 height, and 425 metal ingots. Oh, a lot of metal ingots. And then you can put it on. And then you can ride your awesome beast. Check it out. Isn't it looking good? I think it looks awesomely good. <laughs> well, and then you can do whatever you want, of course. You can eat creatures with it. Just like that. <laughs> so this is going fast. And uh, it is also going over rocks. At least a little bit. When they are too steep, then it doesn't do it. So kind of similar like the Titan Boa, but not totally. So left click is the bite attack, right click is the poison ball, and C is doing this. I don't know if that is some kind of raw, raw uh, taunt attack. So uh, let's check with the friendly creature if it is taunting or not. So we're gonna go this way. Let's check it out. Are we taunting now? No, we are not taunting. Let's check the ball. There we go. Awesome. And shooting those poison balls, it is quite easily, because you have the marker, you can just go and hit them. <laughs> awesome. Something else that is also cool with this creature is you can bury under the ground. So, uh, let me show it to you. Press spacebar, or the jump, the jump button, and you go under the ground. You're like this. And now you think, well, I'm under the ground like a uh, dead worm. No, you're not. There's nothing there. But the nice thing is, you can move. Check it out. You can also only see a cloud, a dust cloud. And once you're out of stamina, then it comes up again. So use stamina when you're under the ground. So let's do it again and let's check it out. We go under the ground. And, and as you can see on the right top of the screen, we are using stamina. And that scorpion is trying to attack us, but it cannot attack us. So what we can do is go really fast under the ground. Let me go out of K mode. And there we go. And then we can come up and we can attack creatures. Oh, this is so cool. This, this is just so cool. Everyone needs this. Okay, let's go under the ground again. But what's my uh, health? Or oh, my health, my oxygen, I mean. My oxygen is going down. So uh, you use up oxygen and that makes sense because uh, uh, try it out at home. No, don't try that out at home. But <laughs> if you would put your head in a bucket and uh, pour dirt in that bucket, well, uh, you, you will suffocate as well. So it makes sense that you, uses, uh, uh, that you use oxygen and uh, that's only a good thing, I guess. Well, I think now you know how to tame this one and uh, yeah, how to ride it, what you can do with it, all the abilities. And I think it is really an awesome creature. Sadly, uh, <laughs> I'm a long way from uh, level 85, but uh, yeah, I hope one day I can tame this one in the series as well, because oh my god, they are so cool. And uh, just so you know, the stats, this one is level 30, the stats, I haven't leveled it up. Uh, yeah, it has a massive amount of weight, that is nice, and uh, the health and all the kind of things are also okay. And now we are bleeding, we don't like to bleed, no, 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 no. Come on, yes, it is dead. 
So you're gonna die as well. Bye bye bye. Die die die. Come on. Uh, or maybe not. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You know you want to go to sleep. And of course you can kill yourself as well with the poison ball. So look out for that. <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. Leave any thoughts about this video or whatever in the comment below. And as always, if you haven't already and want to see more of me in the future, then smash that subscribe button like a maniac. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.